Positive Connections, sponsored by Prochaska Howell and Prochaska LLC Law Firm. Flowers are often a symbol of love, and Arlington mom is holding on to that positivity that flowers bring after the death of her daughter. Yeah, she is carrying on her legacy and finding healing through Tina's blooms. Kaysen's Mally Jones has this week's Positive Connections. Vibrancy. Look at that group over there, that ivory color. Aroma. Yeah, it smells amazing. And the soft sounds of nature. It's quiet. There's so much peace in the garden. Phil, Amy Albright's backyard. It's a beautiful place to be. I never get tired of being out here. Flowers are a part of her day today. They bring comfort in the memories that bloom. I want her to be remembered. I, she was um, a wonderful, wonderful kid. So funny, so full of joy and life. Amy's daughter, Tina, died while serving in Iraq in 2018. It is the most devastating thing that you can possibly imagine. In the midst of heartache, the flowers plant hope. The garden brings nothing but happiness. And pay respect. She had a real love of flowers, and she could really see the artistry and the beauty in the flowers. Amy and her daughter Hannah created Tina's Blooms to keep Tina rooted in them. There is no getting over it, but I can move forward with their memory and with the peace that just comes from making other people happy. Taking the flowers outside the garden and sharing the beauty of a bouquet is fulfilling. It's so life-giving. I have not met anyone so far that was not happy to receive the flowers. The characteristics in the garden keep Amy blossoming. So much fun to learn. And continue a legacy passed on to anyone who gets presented with a flower. I'm absolutely in love with these. Amy has big goals for Tina's Blooms. She wants to expand it to become a place where people come and pick flowers, make bouquets, relax, and feel the peace that she feels. Here for you, Mally Jones, KSN News 3.